hello everyone today we are going to learn how we can return a float or double value from the function so let's begin double click on the turbo c icon on the desktop turbo c id is open now select new from the file menu to create new program press f5 to zoom in the window in this program we are going to create a function area which will calculate the area of circle and the function is going to return a float value so without wasting further time let's get started void main closing brace clrscr get ch area say 3.5 okay so this is your function it is going to return a float value that's why we are going to collect that value in another variable AOC AOC equal to area printing the value printf percent f area of circle equal to comma AOC semicolon now we are going to define this function area float area float radius opening brace closing brace note that we are going to return other than integer value from this function we are going to return a float value from this function so if our function is going to return a float value then it is necessary to declare its prototype okay in prototype you have to mention what function is going to return what is the name of function number of arguments in the function and their data type so instead of this variable I can simply write float that's all saving the program first AOC now I am going to define the function so float area of circle area of circle equal to we know the formula to calculate area of circle is pi r square m underscore pi so this is predefined constant by using control f1 you can view this help screen it is defined in mat.h so for pi you can write m underscore pi and these are different pi options okay so I am going to include this file hash include math.h m underscore pi into radius into radius so area of circle equal to pi 
into radius into radius now we are going to return the value of area of circle area of circle okay the program is ready now we can compile it so let's compile it using alt f9 the program is absolutely okay no errors no warnings so we are going to run it control f9 and you can see the function is going to return area of circle so in this way we can return a float or other value from the function hope this video helped you i will see you in another video lesson till then bye thanks for watching